if you've ever thought of making an Avatar The Last Airbender spoof? Um, well, no, we've never thought about it because the, the thing is that Avatar, the show, is so, like, good and funny. Like, I don't see what you what you'd bring to it. Um, with Harry Potter, it's like, you can kind of bring, uh, kind of poke fun at it, and, uh, there are, and, and it's a book, so you can, you can show it visually, um, but Avatar is already, like, a visual, it's a cartoon, and it already is so self-aware and pokes fun at, fun at itself, yeah. that, uh, pretty much there's an episode of Avatar called the Ember Island Players, where they do... A, a play, goofy play version of, of the, the show. show, and it's just like, well, that that'd be it. But um, <laughs> yeah, so they already beat us to it. But I remember um, seeing when the movie came out, the uh, that the Last Airbender. It's really annoying. I can't say Avatar because because that's the name of another James Cameron's movie. Avatar. Uh -huh. um, when the Last Airbender came out, people started uh, like somebody posted like who they cast as. Uh, like which which people, star which kid star kid they would they cast, cast yeah, as yeah. Yeah. which character <laughs> and it's like I was like no 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 this <laughs> cast ain't all wrong and just for fun we I we, was, we did make up a cast we probably never do the play never because do. because we're not funnier than the guys that made the show like those guys are probably the smartest guys in the world and Avatar is the best show that's ever been made. You guys know because you watched every episode. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's amazing. Oh. Yeah. yeah, but... Uh, what, so we made up a cast. Because we were like, the obvious one everybody got was Joey Richter's Sokka. Yeah, mm -hmm. and because he is just like Sokka. Mm -hmm. And then people had like Darren as Zuko, and I was like, no, 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 that's all wrong. <laughs> And I was thinking, and I was thinking, I was making a sandwich one day, and I was like, "What would Darren be? What would he be?" And I was like, "Duh, of course, Darren would be Katara." That's that's just what Darren. I was like, "That's perfect. That's that's perfect. The little waterbending girl. That's that's perfect." And just being, you you dress him so pretty. Yeah, we try to make Darren so pretty, and he'd be Katara. Um. We if we did the if we did the play with the cast members that have been in our stuff, we'd probably have Joey B. Kata uh, Joey B. Saka, Darren B. Katara, um, uh, this girl named Ariel Goldman. Ariel Goldman, who's Weenie and me and my dick, and she's also the owl and Luna Lovegood and Lily. We'd have her be Ang because she is just like Ang. She's just a happy little thing that runs around and she loves to dance and play stuff like that. So we probably have Herbie Ang. Um, mm -hmm. It's like there are a couple of choices for Iro. Like the obvious choice is really Dylan as Iro. Um, Dylan Saunders who plays Dumbledore. But um, that's but we probably wouldn't do it because it's too expected. We'd probably give Dylan something else. But the other obvious one is Joe Walker would play the Fire Lord, and he. We also said that he'd be Admiral Zhao and. Uh, Long Fang. He'd be all no, yeah, not yeah. Long. This is him. Yeah, yeah, that's just you don't know Long Fang's name. It's no, I forgot. It was long. <laughs> I was confusing it with like with the thing from Gundam Wang, but don't worry about it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, I'm, thinking, I'm thinking of White, white Fang. Fang. Yeah. Uh, Excuse that, me. Those are the bad guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, Caitlin um, McLean wants to know if you're ever gonna put the Lord of the Rings parody on YouTube. Um, no, we, we probably won't put the whole thing on YouTube because uh, it's filmed with one camera, and so it's very, very boring. Um, yeah, it's, it's not like, the, we didn't film it like our other shows. The first Harry Potter show is the first thing that we filmed that had like three, a three camera setup and like actually looks presentable. Like we would be so embarrassed if somebody watched the Lord of the Rings show. Because one, it's not it's not as good as we remembered. Because we went back and watched it, and we're like, it's not that, it's not that funny. <laughs> um, like we thought it was really funny, but the audience didn't really think it was that funny. And um, it's one camera the whole time, so it's like kind of boring. It doesn't really cover everything that it should. And it's also um, because it was one camera. There's a whole chunk of the show that's missing when the cameraman was switching tapes. So it's like, it wouldn't even make sense. 
So instead, we just showed the the golem part, which um, and that was the best part of the show. Yeah. So um, we'll have to see. You know, maybe in the future we'll redo Lord of the Rings. We're not sure. That was yeah. That was one idea we were kicking around was redoing the Lord of the Rings uh, show and making it a musical and re re making it better this time. But um, I don't know if we do it because there's already a Lord of the Rings musical. Yeah, there's a Lord of the Rings musical called... Um, there's, oh. a, there's a real one called Lord of the Rings, but then there's also a parody musical called Fellowship. Um, and we actually know the people that made Fellowship, so I felt like if, if we um, made a version, it would be kind of like disrespectful to them. Because um, I really like those guys, and it's a really funny show. So if anyone wants a Lord of the Rings parody, they should like look up Fellowship. It's a, it's really good, fun time. I don't know if it's on YouTube, but I think probably clips from it are on YouTube. But you know, um, we may just go. Ah, let's just do it. For yeah, fun. we might just do it, it for fun. It's anyway. like we would we wouldn't try to do like they theirs is an actual show that has a run. Um, ours would just be a YouTube. Yeah, ours would just be a for fun YouTube thing that would be like um, all the people that made it the first time kind of coming back and saying, let's make it better this time. So uh, we might do that, but we probably won't release the version that we have filmed because it's disgusting. It's, yeah, it's gross. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, I think this is the last fan question we're going to do, but um, Chrissy Dibas, I'm not sure how to say that, um, wanted to know, at the end of the recording for Stutter on the soundtrack, um, it sounds like Darren just says eclipse. Well, he says, he says he says he's he's talking about the sound. He said it clipped. Yeah, oh. it's actually a mess up. Uh, when they were producing the album, they forgot to cut that out. It's just it's just they were recording, mm -hmm. and when you record something, it like turns it into a clip or like cuts off at the end. So Darren said it clipped. Um, but then they just forgot to cut that out, and it sounds like he says Eclipse, yeah. but he doesn't. Okay. Because um, people thought it was like a hidden message or something. Yeah, that's what yeah. I think people think But it's actually about. not. Don't worry. No, we don't, know, we don't know too much about Twilight. Yeah, we don't know very much about it. That's after our time. Yeah. Okay. Um, so yeah. I think that's all the questions we have for you guys.